absolutely getting a good chat. But if you've worked with some people who uh, have a great flow and a sense of humour, then uh, you'll know what I'm talking about, Kareem. It can be tremendous. It can be an absolute hoot. I think also you'll find that there's so much stress around in the workplace at the moment that it's very important that people feel they have a go-to place. And their go-to place is Scotty McClue's live stream on YouTube. And that's uh, what will happen, I can tell you. It may take a bit of time, but it will happen. And we like that. Very, very important. We like that. Uh, oh, my goodness me. Right. And the memory should be arriving for the computer. And what we'll do is we'll pop that in. Uh, the pubs will be shut during the old firm match. What will the fans do? The fans, I will do a live stream and the fans can come on and have a chat with Scotty McClure and we'll have a virtual pint. What about that? Not to hit, you know, fantastic. Uh, because I told you the other day, I think we should actually not ban alcohol, but just phase it out because there's no requirement for it. You know what I mean? People need to keep their wits about them. So there we go. So during the old firm match, I think Scotty McClure should live stream. When's the next one? And uh, we'll do that. Why are cartons so expensive? Well, I think anybody, uh, you know, paying a lot for a pair of cartons needs to pull themselves together. See what I just did there? Um, no, I think what it is, Kareem, it depends on the area. If you live in an area where there's a perception, and it's only a perception, that people might have a little bit more money than some other areas, and it's only a perception, um, then uh, they think they can load the price a bit. So you've got to knock a bit off it. So depending on who you're getting them from, you know, I mean, I went when I went to Manchester, I stayed in a lovely part of Manchester, and Manchester's such a massive city, you can get anything you like. And um, I remember I needed curtains for uh, a beautifully double glazed, double doors French window in this uh, lovely little sitting room. And I thought, what colours do I want? Right. And I went round to an old mill factory, an old mill factory, and here was a lady who made cut price curtains. And I went in and I chose the material and she made me gorgeous big double curtains. I can't remember what I paid for them. I wonder if it was something like 39 pounds or something like that. But it, 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 it wasn't much and she did a beautiful job. And these curtains looked magnificent. So it just depends. Shop around, I would say, Kareem. So there we are. Curtains are expensive and carpets, but not as expensive as they used to be. I wouldn't be surprised if a carpet now isn't too much far off the price it was 30 years ago when there was money about in this country. So there. Why do you call Mrs. McLeod darling? <coughs> darling! Numpty Head wants to know why I call you darling. Big pardon? I've heard it somewhere. Now, come on. Ah. She says it's because I love her. What do we think, Numpty Head? There we go. There we are. That's it from the horse's mouth. I can tell you straight from the horse's mouth. Never look a gift horse in the mouth as it's the other end that feeds your rhubarb. Have you ever heard that one? There's a wee one for you. I can tell you. Wonderful. Right. We'll get that down. There we are. And, um, yes. Wonderful. Now then. That's that. We'll just